Okay, I understand you have a quite a Kim habit. I've been stealing from both of them for years to get my fix. Where do I even start? Well, I'll figure something out. Take this key. It's to my private stash in the water treatment plant. Just get rid of the stuff. Burn it, sell it. I don't care what happens to it. Nice. There we go. We got 85 caps. We got mint hats, Timpex, Jet. Let's go. What's going on, this is Johnny, and welcome to episode number two of Fallout 3, one of my favorite games of all time. So if you guys are enjoying it, make sure you guys do the YouTube stuff, like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends, you guys know the YouTube drill. And I just found this sign, we're dying, assholes, with a skeleton. Uh, last episode, we, we, wait, what's this one say? Let us in, mother effers. <laughs> My god, well we just we just got out of the vault and now we're outside in the wasteland So we're gonna see what we can get into. Um, this is modded. Um, if you guys haven't seen the first episode um, I'm gonna start within the first few episodes actually, but It's graphically updated um, It should run a little better. I'm not really for sure. It is when Windows 10 if you guys don't know about Fallout 3 and Windows 10 It doesn't like each other. Um, it just doesn't. Why is there three frag grenades? In here, we gotta go sell stuff. That's uh, our main thing right now. The first thing we're gonna do is a thing that I always do, or always ended up doing. Also, okay, I was gonna say the the, the music should be off, but wait, is it not off? Let me look here real quick. Yeah, music should be off. Radio is also off, so should be good there. But the main thing I do. Is once you go to Megaton, you're gonna talk to the guy named Moriarty. He's in the bar. He's gonna send you on a quest to come down here to this small ranch. And inside is a woman. Who the hell are you? Named Silver. Where'd you come from? Did Moriarty send you? See? Who's Moriarty? Colin Moriarty. The owner of Moriarty Saloon in Megaton. That sack of shit is convinced that I'm some crazy junkie who stole money from him. Okay. Now, if everything goes right, we can do the speech 42, and you say, look, just give me the caps, and I'll tell them you're gone. I'm tired of hiding out here like some kind of wasteland dog. Okay. I guess you're right. Here. This is all I have. Please leave me alone now. Now, four caps added. Now, I'm pretty sure... Let's go ahead and save it. If I, if I can remember right, if we kill her... Careful. Like this. Hold on. I'm just gonna look here, just gonna look. Yeah, we can make another hundred on, on her. Um, and that's what we're gonna do. Reason being is because we had we had some caps. Uh why okay, there we go. Let's do let's, what god man, I'm trying to find something that's not worth so much. We're only down by one. Oh my gosh. Let's do pre war baseball cap. Wait. Yeah, we'll give her that. That will work 210. Now we can actually start walking again. Um, if we need to, we can always come back. She's got some psycho and stuff like that, but... I don't know. I'm really not really too worried about karma in this game at the moment. Um, I'm just playing because it's one of my favorite games of all time. I haven't played in years. So, we'll see what happens. Man, this game looks so pretty, man. It really, really does. It looks incredible. Now, I did mod it, like I said earlier, and you can actually go in places, if I did, I, th I think I enabled it, but there's places within the within the wasteland that, that are, like, are boarded up and you can't actually walk into, but I modded it to where we can actually go into those places now, so we'll see what, what happens there. We got a caravan out here. What is this? Is this gonna give us that one stuff? Oh, there's another one. Welcome, welcome. My name is Crow, and I travel the land offering vestments of protection. And you are fortunate I found you in time. You bear the look of one who is haunted, but I am proud to say that my wares can protect you from even the cruel claws of death itself. Have a look. Um, here by. Have a look. All right, let's see what we got here. We got armor. Damage resistance is leather armor. Um, I really don't think we're going to do anything too crazy. I don't really think we're going to need it since we are an easy. I think we're going to leave it a go. 
I think we're good. Walk well, friend. Actually, whoa, whoa, wait, whoa, 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 come here, come here, come here. Here to acquire and shut up. Um, he is look. eighty-eight. See if anything calls out to you. Let's go to this. We'll sell him this. I'm gonna sell him the tunnel snake. I know people are gonna be like, oh my god, don't do that, but I'm gonna do it anyway. I want to just sell him all his stuff until I can't no more. Uh, we have a bunch of these, and then we can come in here like that. So what I did there is I just sold him a bunch of stuff, and then I also it, it went over the 88 caps he already had in his inventory, and so I went ahead and throw two stim packs in from him to give to me, and it equaled out. So he actually only gave me about 80. Names Lucas then we got Sims, stim packs. town sheriff, and mayor too when the need arises. Nice town you got here, sheriff. It's a pleasure to meet you. Friendly and well mannered. I think we're gonna get along just fine. You treat my people nice, and you're welcome to stay as long as you'd like. Right message received. I'm glad we understand each other. Now, is there something I can help you with? Nope. Uh, I'm looking for my father. Nope. Sorry. I got enough fires to put out in this place that I don't have time to keep tabs on every visitor. I'd ask around town. Okay. Uh, let's discuss this bomb. What about it? It's just right over his left shoulder, or I guess his technically his right shoulder, but for you guys and for me, it's his left one. The one with a gun. Um, do you think someone should disarm the that thing? We should, we should build a town around the bomb. That's crazy. One day that thing is going to go off. You're living on a borrowed time. I don't trust any one. of the locals to tinker with it. Besides, most people don't even realize it's still a threat. And hell, Cromwell and those crazies from the Church of Adam, they worship the damn thing. Why? Do you think you got the know-how to disarm it? For good? I can see about disarming that bomb for you. Oh, all right. Fine. But listen here. Just take a look at it first. Go easy. If you get the job done, there'll be 100 caps in it for you. Oh man, I don't think we'll be able to do the 22% the one. Not an option, I'm afraid. We aren't exactly rolling in cash down here. Um... I don't need a reward, I can... Uh, let's do 100 caps. Alright. Okay. Wait, hold on. God, there's a way that you can do it to where he'll tell you more about your dad. Well, that's mighty decent of you. Just don't... Alright, now that I'm off helping, you might... Maybe you can help me. I'm looking for my dad. There we go. Well, come to think of it, I do remember a stranger coming through here. Had a look in his eye. You know the kind a man gets when he's got a purpose. Spend some time up in the saloon. Might want to check with Moriarty. Just watch yourself. That man's trouble. All right, perfect. I know exactly where that's at, so we don't have to leave her about that. All right, now we're in Megaton. His salon is right, or his saloon is Hello. right here. And then you got Mora, Mora, Mor Myra. Can't remember her name. It's up here to the right, which is the general thing. Here's the bomb. Twenty-five or higher required. Okay. Yeah, we can always come back to that. Now, this is the, one of the biggest decisions in this game regarding whether you're going to be a good person or you're a bad person. Now, the two things, you have two options. You can either A, disarm it, or, I'll go ahead and show you guys that. I'm kind of playing this game as if no one's ever played this game before. Because I know a lot of people probably haven't, but there are going to be people that have definitely watched this Let's Play that are going to be like, Yo, I love this game, and I'm with you. I'm really talking to people that really haven't watched this. But if you go in here, we talk to Moriarty. Let's go ahead and save it. We haven't saved in a while. I know I just auto saved, but that's okay. That guy right here, he's waving us over. He's a bad guy. All right. Let's go ahead and talk to him. My my, just when I had all but given up hope, my dear boy, I'm very happy to make your acquaintance. I. I am Mr. Burke, and you, well, you are not a resident of this putrescent cesspool that makes you a rather valuable individual. Mr. Burke, is it? Please continue. I find myself enthralled. Finally, someone with a modicum of civility and common sense. 
I represent certain interests, and those interests view this town, this megaton, as a blight on a burgeoning urban landscape. You have no connections here, no interest in this cesspool's affairs or fate. You could assist us in erasing this little accident off the map. Go on, I'm listening. The undetonated atomic bomb for which this town is named is still very much alive. All it needs is a little <laughs> motivation. I have in my possession a fusion pulse charge, constructed for a singular purpose. The detonation of that bomb. You'll rig it to the bomb, then you'll get paid handsomely. What do you say? So an extra 500 cows and you got yourself a deal. Is that the best you can do? <laughs> Sims wants me to disarm the bomb. Sims is an idiot. He prides himself on his position as mayor and sheriff of this scrapyard. I told Sims to disarm him if some extra cows would change my mind. Indeed. There we go. A man's word is worth his weight in caps. There we go. Now we got the 500. I suppose I could arrange for a bonus of, say, 500 caps in addition to the base fee. When it's done, meet me at Tenpenny Tower, southwest of here, well out of harm's way. You can't miss it. Any questions? Oh, man. We're messing with the bomb seems pretty technical. What if I can't do it? We're talking a little of innocent lives here, Burke. Can I warn them? It's time for me to go. Lack the aptitude, you mean. You're not rewiring the thing, just attaching the pulse charge to the detonator. If you get stumped, talk to Leo Stahl. He might have something to help you concentrate. He's got a bit of a reputation. Okay, it's time for me to go. Don't let me keep you. Radio. All right, now we can get some mintats, and that allow us to actually do stuff with that. So, God, where is Moriarty? Megaton Settler, Lucy West. Just slap my ass. Damn it! What's wrong with you, Nova? Hey there. Hey. Looking for my father, a middle-aged guy. Maybe you've seen him? Yeah, I remember that man. I saw him talking to Moriarty. It's hard to forget handsome men like that. Enough with the tough chick routine. Tell me more. Look, if you can give me more information or point, point me in the right direction... Yeah, I'll help you. Then Moriarty kicks my sweet ass out the door. Sorry, kid. If you want to know more, Moriarty is the only one who's gonna help you. Talk to Gob. He hates Moriarty more than I do. Maybe he'll tell you something. But I doubt it. Alright. Mmm. So what's it take to hire you? Radio station. It's all about this news galaxy galaxy news radio. Are you serious? Oh, you must have come from that vault, right. It's the only free radio station left in the wasteland. The guy who runs it, Three Dog, he's like the only person who seems to give a shit. He keeps talking about fighting the good fight or something. Better than the crap on the other station. Okay. I have to go. Alright, this is what the guy here she was talking. This is Gob. Hey, smooth skin. Do you need something? A drink, maybe? Anything? Anything at all? God, fuck, what are you? Stuff it, ghoul. Ain't stop looking at me. Tell me, uh. Let me think about it a moment for my good Wait. man. Beat you if I feel like it. I hadn't planned on it. Well, now, that's a surprise. I'm used to every asshole smooth skin in this town giving me shit just because I look like a corpse. I'm glad to see that there are a few worthwhile people around here. Listen, Moriarty'd have my head if he caught me selling at a discount. But for you, I'll risk it. Nice. Getting good karma. I'm actually doing really well with karma. Um, I'm looking for my father, middle aged guy. Maybe you've seen him? Oh, yeah. I do remember a guy like that. Honestly, I usually keep my head down. I tend to get smacked around if I look customers in the eyes. But talk to Moriarty, he'll know more. God, please, if you know anything but my father, you need to tell me. I was like you once. I wandered into town looking for an escape from this stupid joke of a body I'm trapped in. Now look at me. Very well. Moriarty keeps a computer terminal in the back. On it, he keeps all of the goings on in Megaton. If you can get onto that terminal, I'll bet he has information on your dad. Now get away from me, smooth skin. If Moriarty even suspects I told you this, I'm a dead ghoul. 
Perfect. Alright, where is Moriarty? That's not Moriarty there, that's Billy. Yeah, he's, he's outside. Okay, there he is, there he is, there he is. Colin Moriarty. Always pleased to see a new face. But I'm afraid you've had the misfortune to catch me, well, out of me element. I'm the owner and proprietor of Moriarty's, you see. The saloon? But please, see for yourself. Come by for a drink or twelve. You and I, oh, we're going to be fast friends. Fast friends. Look my father, middle aged guy, maybe you've seen him? My god, it's you. The little baby boy all grown up. Persistent little bastard, ain't ya? Then and now it would seem. It's been a long time, kid. Oh, your daddy passed through here all right. Here and gone. Got what he came for and then left. I I'm assuming you'll do the same, correct? Huh? My father and I were born in Vault 101. Is that what your father told you? That you were born in that hole? That he was born there as well? Oh, the lies we tell to those we love. Your father brought you to the vault right after you were born. To keep you safe, you see. I remember it well you stayed in my saloon after all. That's right. Your father, his brotherhood a steel friend, and you, the suckling babe with nary a tit to suckle. Sorry about your mom, truly. Ah, but life goes on. Daddy lied. Life's full of little disappointments. And now you're all grown up and wondering where he's gone to. My dad told me you were born in Vault 101. Oh, I wasn't born in the vault. That's complete bullshit. And you know it. You're wrong. My dad never would lie to me. Oh my god, don't. Ah, I see. You know well, the I first heard one. about the brainwashing that goes on down there. From some I don't want to go on his bad escaped. side. Oh, five years back. All hail the overseer. We're born in the vault. We die in the vault and all that other assorted lunacy. Kid, you've got better programming than our own deputy weld. You'd best wise up quick. Wouldn't want anyone taking advantage of you, hmm? Uh, so we can do the 44% one. You seem like a Damn nice it. kid, so I'm going to be straight with you. Your dad was here, and now he's not. And yes, I know where he went. But what you're asking me for is information. And information is a commodity. And like any commodity, it must be sold at a reasonable market price. So, what's reasonable? Let's say, oh, 100 cops, and daddy's location's yours. All right, Maureen, here's 100 cats and I was my father. I know things are fun on my own. <laughs> Will you? <laughs> well, good luck with that. So, when you change your mind, come see me. I'm usually at the saloon. A hundred caps. Daddy wouldn't think twice if it were you out there. Okay. This is what we're gonna do. We're gonna try to... break into his computer. He's not coming in, so... That's good. So let's go ahead and go back in. There we go. I found it. What's up, Jericho? I'm gonna close that. Okay, let's go ahead and save it. And we'll go here. Oh, I need a science of 50? Job. Dang it. I wonder if I can get in here. We gotta find the password. Bada bing. Got it. Go. Boom. All right, here we go, here we go. Residence. Doc Church, Leo Jericho, we don't want that. I want visitors. James, Volto 101. Out of nowhere, James came back to Megaton. Since he stayed here before that, he asked me where the hell he could get a lay of the land and find out what's going on in the world. I told him about the Galaxy News Radio and the ruins of DC and that guy 3Dog. Then like that, he was gone again. I remember the first time he showed up almost 20 years ago. I never expected someone to actually want to or be able to get into a vault, but he must have had his reasons. He had his kid with him, some baby. That wouldn't shut the fuck up. Not only that would have kicked someone like that out of my place, but he had a way with words. Then, like that, he ducks into Vault 101 and he's gone for almost 20 years. Nice guy, I guess, but never spends enough caps. Perfect. We did lose some karma there, but that's alright. Okay, good to go. Got something on your mind? We can get up out of here now. Let's go ahead and save again. Always gotta be constantly saving in this game because if it crashes, I really don't feel like redoing a bunch of stuff, so. Okay, we gotta we, we gotta wait. 841.
All right, I think we can go in here, can we not? What, what time they open? I think it's nine o'clock is when they open. Yep. Later side of supply. Let's go ahead and sell the rest of our stuff here, and this is also going to give us a hey. I mission. hear you're that stray from the vault. Oh, I haven't seen one of you for years. Good to meet you. I'm Moira Brown. Moira. I run Craterside Supply, but what I really do is mostly tinkering and research. Say, I'm working on a book about the wasteland. It'd be great to have the foreword by a vault dweller. Help me out, would you? Check out putting a save about life in the vault. Great. Just tell me what it's like to live underground all your life, or or to come outside for the first time, or whatever strikes your fancy. It was paradise down there. No fear, no worries, no fighting. So dad left. A runaway dad, huh? I've seen plenty of them before, but none with the big 101 on their back. Good luck finding him. Maybe the armored vault suit will help you out there, huh? That'll be good for the book. In fact, want to help me with the research? I can pay you, and it'll be fun. Ooh, 101 jumpsuit. What's the book you're working on? Um. Well, it's a dangerous place out there in the wastes, right? People could really use a compilation of good advice, like a wasteland survival guide. For that, I need an assistant to test my theories. I wouldn't want anyone to get hurt because of a mistake. Nobody's ever happy when that happens. No, then they just yell a lot at me with mean, mean words. Sounds like a great idea. Um, can't wait to help. Good enthusiasm! Now, I think the first chapter will have to be about surviving day-to-day -day dangers. Things like where it is and isn't safe to find food, the dangers of radiation, and how to avoid and even profit from dangerous landmines. Ooh, sounds like fun, doesn't it? Which do you want to do first? Um, let's do the getting food. Well, food and medicine. Everyone needs them once in a while, right? So they need a good place to find them. There's an old super duper mart not far from here. I need to know if a place like that still has any food or medicine left in it. Yeah, I'll check it out. Oh, great! Food is most important, but see if you can get medicine, too. And if there's nothing to find, then just come back in one piece, okay? Let's talk about collecting the stuff from the Super Duper Mart. So, how's the scaving been? Got the food and medicine from that Super Duper Mart? If we can lie to it, we're gonna do it. Nothing's there. Do you think I suddenly lost track Game of time or something? <laughs> There's no way you've gone there and back in the blink of an eye like that. Okay. Wait, well, let's see if we have any, um... What do you need? So we can, um, sell some stuff here. Got a pistol that can be sold. Um, let's see here. We could actually sell this back to her, but I don't think we're gonna do that. We're gonna sell all my BBs. My BB gun. Two weapons. Um, I think we'll good. I think we'll be good on this. Let's keep the good one. Sell all of these. Apparel. This is does eight. We have a twelve one, so we can get rid of that. And we'll do all of these. Jumpsuits. Hey. Do all these vodka. That's that's thirty bucks, or I guess you could say. Caps. Uh, we're gonna get rid of the comic book because that's not gonna do much for our safety. Do all the pre war money. Turpentines. Scrap metals, wander glue, paint gun. Actually, we're gonna need some of this stuff if we wanna do some of the schematic stuff, but that's okay. Aid. Let's do stim packs. Um, let's see here. What kind of guns do you have? Missile launcher. I know she has the rock it launcher eventually, but yeah, that's okay. Give me the 127. Good, Good enough for now. All right. I think we can leave here. I know we can I do a mercenary, you. but I think we'll be all right there. All right. Okay, I think we can probably leave here actually. I don't really don't think. Wait, can we, re can we repair these? Wait, hold on. There is actually a person, if I can remember right. 
that it has us go around town. Will you get me up here? I think that's gonna be our house eventually if we want to. With the Sims. Um Is it here, I think? Yeah, water plant. You can get a quick mission here if you want to. If I can find the guy. Oops. It'll hold it pretty long. Shack door, here we go. Yeah, what is it? Uh, what can I do to help around here? Well, it's no secret that the old water treatment plant is on its last legs. And I'm the only one in town that can keep the damn thing running. I spend so much time up in the plant that I can't take care of the leaks that keep springing up in the pipes around town. Now, I don't expect much from strangers, but if you've got the know-how, I need someone to hunt down and repair those leaks. How many leaks are there? From the pressure in the plant, my guess is that there are three of them scattered around town. Check along the pipes and the valves, but they might be a bit tricky to spot. Okay, how can how can't you fix it? I'll keep it in mind. I hope you can help. If folks knew how bad it was getting up here, well, I don't know what would happen. All right. Uh, have you go home? Alright, so what we're gonna do here is we're definitely just gonna, like, do as much things as we can within Megaton before we leave. I think, I think that'd be a good idea. Try to capitalize on time and wasteful, uh, fast travel. So, the first one is here. I think there's one back there as well, but I can't, I can't really remember. Okay, I need a repair of 30. Man, I really need to get those Mintats, don't I? Does, is this who I gotta talk to? Well, He's the one with the Mintats. Damn. You're new, right? Name's Leo Stahl. It's a pleasure. It's a pleasure! Yeah! Okay, I see you have a quiet Kim habit. Who's in charge here? I don't know, I wanna... Damn it! Who told you I... I mean... I have no idea what you're talking about. It's okay, Leo, I wanna help. Help? What's to help? So I'm a junkie. Big fucking deal. It's not like I'm hurting anyone. You're hurting your family, Leo. Jenny and I and Andy care about you. I... I guess you're How right. I came up with Andy, I have no idea. I have to tell them about my problem, don't I? That would be a good idea. I just don't know what to say. I've been stealing from both of them for years to get my fix. Where do I even start? Well, I'll figure something out. Look, I want to thank you for your help. I guess it took a complete stranger to show me what an ass I've been. Take this key. It's to my private stash in the water treatment plant. Just get rid of the stuff. Burn it, sell it. I don't care what happens to it. Nice. Made the right choice, Leo. Thanks. It'll be hard, but I'll do my best. Okay. Talk. We are going to go ahead and leave. And there's, I mean, there's darts here. We can get that dart gun eventually later, too. Alright, let's go ahead and leave here. Go try to find this. Your suffering shall exist. Let's go try to find this thing, shall we? Um Find the stash and Leo's no treatments. Or er, stash in the What? What what am I trying to say to me? Or do you guys touch the water treatment plant for Mintax? Jeez. Alright. Is it up is it up that is it here? Or is it up here? I just felt like an idiot, too. Now I gotta walk all the way back up there. I'm a mess. I'm a complete freaking mess. We gotta get these mintats, though. Water fountain. Okay. Use key. There we go. We got 85 caps. We got mintats, Timpex, jet. Let's go. That was perfect. Okay. Nice. Now we got that. We got those mintats. We have enough mintats now. We should be able to go and fix um, the leaks. I'm hoping. If we don't, we can always come back and do it as well. We also have we should have enough mintats to um, to disarm that as well. So we can go ahead and check this out. We'll probably save it before this happens. Let's see here. I think it'll only last a certain amount, right? Let's go ahead and save. Go ahead and open this up. Let's go here. Aid. Mintats. 
Uh, to the fix it. Boom, we got it. All right, let's move over here. Let's see if we can fix this as well. Attempt to disarm the bomb. You have successfully disarmed the bomb. Perfect. Now we can talk to Sims. I'll be damned. And he should you be getting a house. Didn't you? you disarmed that thing. And all without asking for pay, too. Hell, why don't you move in? Here's the key and the deed to an empty Let's house. Go. Consider yourself a megaton citizen. Oh, and talk with Moira at Craterside Supply. She's got random odds and ends you might be able to spruce the place up with. All right, let's go. Okay, perfect. All right, we gotta go find the rest of these leaks. We leveled up too. Perfect. Let's do repair. Actually, hold on. We got 16 now. We'll do speech up to 40. We'll do medicine to 50. That way, it's all the way up. We'll do lock pick up to 41. We'll continue. Okay, we could all. We, I guess we could do intense training. Let's see here. Swift learner. With each training of the swift learner perk, you gain an additional 10% of total experience points whenever experience points are earned. That's not bad. Here's the vault little league MVP. Have honed your hitting and throwing with every rank. You gain 5 points of many weapons skill and 5 points of explosive. You're obsessed with using and uh, maintaining a wide variety of conventional farms. With each rank of gun nut perk, you gain an additional 5 points to small guns and repair skill. Yeah, we'll go for gun nut. Reason being, is so we get to repair the small guns, but we're gonna get that up anyway. I just feel like that would be a good idea. Our house should be up here to the right. What I want to do is, our yeah, house is right there. I want to try to finish up these leaks, but I can't remember exactly where the leaks are. Hmm. There's one there. I just saw that one. There's one, like, right here. Okay. Um, how do I fix it? Oh, there it is. Bada bang. We need one more. Do you see any more leaking? Isn't there one, like, down here somewhere? I don't see him. This ancient weapon of war is our salvation. Last one's right here. Bada boom. All right, that should be all three of them now. Maybe we can go back and talk to what's his face. I can't remember exactly what his name is. Off the top. That'll give us enough time. Then we'll go check our house out. And then maybe if we have enough time, we'll go and talk to Mora, more more Myra, Mori, Moria, Mora. I can't, I can't ever say her name. I'm just a dumb, dumb. Uh, my brain b breaks every time I try to say her name. All right, Walter, come here. What do you need? Figured it out. I got it. I did it. All pipes well, fixed. Be. I did the it. The pressure's up in the plant. It looks like all the leaks have been fixed. Thank you, stranger. Thank you. But listen, it's only a matter of time before they burst again. And someone like you might not be around to fix them. I'll make you a deal. I'll give you caps for any scrap metal you can bring me. You'll find it all over the place out there in the waste. If I have a steady supply of scrap, I can keep the plant running and the pipe should be just fine. We got a deal? Aye, right, Captain. Sounds good to me. Good. This just keeps looking better. Those parts will keep this place running and the town in fresh water. Hurry back as soon as you find some. I actually just had some, but I think I sold it. Forgot about that. That's alright, though. It is what it is. Go ahead and check our house out really quick. Nothing too fancy. Now, the thing that I said earlier, I think it might have been either this episode or the last, is when you have, you have, a, you have a choice. You can either not explode the bomb, and you have, a, you have this house here, or you can explode it, and then you can go to Ten Penny Tower and get a suite. But I think we'll go for the good the good times here. Wait, did I get the other bobblehead? I don't think I got the other bobblehead in the in the thing. I'm pretty sure there's two of them in the vault. I'm actually mad about that. I should have got the second one. Oh well. It is what it is. We got some food here. Um 
put the purified water in. I don't think we're gonna need that. Nothing too crazy. It's not bad. It'll do. It'll do. You definitely need to spruce it up a little bit, but... What's in here? Auto caps. Darts. We'll, we'll leave all this stuff here. Um, let's take a good nap. I think this should give our health back up as well. Alright, let's go ahead and leave. Go talk to Mor Moria. I can't freaking say her name, man. The, the chick. The chick. Let's go talk to her and see what she's got for sale. If anything at all, to be honest. And I can't remember, do you just get it? Or does she does this automatically just, uh, uh, just be in the house? Like she puts it there for you. What's up, Nathan? So, how's the scavenging been? You might be able to do this too, got as the well. Food medicine from that super duper mart? Um, I haven't got around to it yet. Oh, well, could you get on that? Thanks. Hey, okay, thanks. Buying stuff for my house. Good to see that old house finally found an owner. I have all sorts of items and themes for that place that may interest you. So about your themes. Can you tell me what the items do? Of course I can. Which one in particular interests you? Um, my first infirmary, jukebox, my first laboratory, Nuka-Cola machine, workbench, there's nothing about the items. Um, I think we're okay there. What are the themes? Some people don't like living in a boring old house. Purchase a theme from me, and I use all of my design abilities to set your place up in the manner you request. You can choose from the vault, raider, wasteland explorer, science, Love machine or pre-war themes. Um, I don't remember what any of these look like, so we're gonna sure. just not do it right now. Okay, let's have a look at your stuff sure here. Thing. Okay, can we go to? Is there like not a? Okay, here we go. Here, house. Here we go. Oh my gosh, seventeen seventy-two. My lord, house workbench. I think we're, I think we're good on that. I mean, yeah, we are definitely good here. I don't think we're gonna need the majority of this stuff right now. Anyway, um, yeah, we're good. All right, go back out. Now we know what we can get. We get once we get enough money, we can actually start getting that stuff. But for right now, if we just start. It's only, only uh, episode number two, so we have plenty of time. All right, guys. We're gonna be uh, stopping it right here. It's now raining. Let's go back home before we get all wet and get radiation. So let's get out of here. Let's go ahead and go inside. All right, guys. So we're gonna call episode number two of the Fall Three Let's Play. If you guys are enjoying it, make sure you guys do the YouTube thing, like, comment, subscribe, and show your friends. As always, guys, my name is Johnny, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next episode of Fall Three or anything else we can get our hands on. We have so many games coming out, especially in November. We got Call of Duty coming up and Cyberpunk. Which is like the biggest game of this year and I cannot wait. So if you guys are excited for Cyberpunk and you guys like what you guys see here, make sure you do subscribe because we're doing a full Let's Play for that. And yeah, see you guys soon. Bye.